Hey guys, Dr. Price here, and please subscribe to this station, guys. For more videos, subscribe, and that way, every time a new video pops up, you guys will know it. So let's talk about today. Uh, anybody have any fever or joint pain? This is already coming to the office this time of year. So when I see this fever and this joint pain, remember the literature. This is not just for me. There's a, there's a small group of people on this planet right now who are doing nothing but researching. And what they're discovering is Anytime you're having these fevers and these chills and these flu-like symptoms, that nothing more has entered your body but a man-made virus. And what are these things made from? Venom. Okay, mark my words, guys. This is venom. Anytime you feel like you've been invaded with your body, you're having some joint pain and fever. I'm going to repeat it again. This is venom. And what has been shown over and over again to block the receptor sites where venom attaches to your, your receptors in your body. You want to block them with nicotine, guys. So out there, everybody listening, don't just take my word from it. Take the medical literature that most of these doctors out here are avoiding to look at or told not to look at and not to examine because it's very cheap and expensive to go get a nicotine patch and stick it on your arm, guys. Now, guys, the most surprising things about this, about nicotine patches, is it takes a very low dose and uh, to have the effect to block the venom from getting into your body. And we're talking like venom, not just from snakes, spiders, and scorpions. It's like lions, tigers, and bears. You know, you know the story, right? So this is out there, and all these venoms and toxins are now into your food system, into the yeast we discussed before. There was two we talked about earlier. Now they've been found to be in over a dozen different forms of yeast, viper venom being produced, snake peptides. Some insane, sinister people out there are trying to destroy our food, or they really have destroyed our food. But before it destroys you and destroys your life and your family's health, do something about it. Now, besides putting a nicotine patch, which online you can find them from 7 milligrams to 14 milligrams, very low dose. And it's funny, during the shot crisis that we had, the bioweapon episodes we had, all the people who didn't get sick did what? They smoked. Look at Europe. All the smokers did not get sick. Why was that? Nicotine. Now, I'm not saying this is a good time to pick up cigarettes and start smoking again. That's not what I'm saying, okay? That's why people go, oh, I smoke, so no, good for me. No, what I'm saying is use only as needed. And that way of putting the patch, it doesn't have to enter through the lungs. So, guys, like, again, don't take my word for it. Put a patch on somebody and watch the results or on yourself. Now, another thing, diabetes. Autism, these hyperactive children, ADHD, all these all these names they give everybody for conditions that are really poisoning of chemicals. Because really, if you have a kid who has autism spectrum, you have ADHD, these things, these neurological behaviors that they try to they try to fix a child through behavior training. If you do a chemical test like I do, metabolite testing, you're gonna see they have all these pesticides, insecticides, all these neurological damaging chemicals in their system. These things not only damage the chemistry that cause cancer, and they do hormone disruptions. They're endocrine disruptors is the name they call these. So yes, do the easy fix. Get your nicotine patches. If you have long COVID-like things where you feel like you still lost your taste, your smell, put a patch on. Within 10 minutes, you're probably going to return your taste and your smell. I've watched this over and over in the office. I know it works. And so I'm telling you from upstairs, from the research that no one's reading, it's there. Now, also, I'm going to remind you of the, the products that we carry, uh, our key essentials. That's ki-essentials.com, our website. You look at all the herbal blends we have in there. Yes, some that you should have this time of year stored into your, your cabinets at home. You should have the CPEL, which is like a natural antibiotic of the herbs. You have Virapel. And then you have Infection Fighter. Those are the three most popular selling herbal blends that we have, and they do their job. Now, I'm telling you what I do. This time of year, I take the CPEL, which has lots of golden seal root in it, and I just take a sip of it every morning. Even though I don't feel any symptoms of anything, it's a preventative. You're putting those herbs in your body to start saturating your blood to start doing their job. And what, and what that is is preventing bacteria from growing and helping uh, your immune system be strong, guys. So herbal blends, guys, they have a kid's cold for the children. You can mix it in a little juice and have the children take it. Works wonderful. Guys, get your children used to taking herbs now at an early age. Start putting them in a little juice that they like. Take the herbs and get them used to the flavor of the herbs. And believe me, 
once your alkalinity changes in your body, once you become more alkaline instead of so acidic in your body, you begin to taste differently. Because people taste an herb, they go, oh, yeah, yeah, here, let me have this icy from the filling station, right? Well, that means you're highly acidic and probably full of candida, full of mold, and probably full of parasites. Those are those worms again, right? But as soon as your body begins to change its pH, herbs begin to taste differently. I can't tell you enough about herbs. So guys, get your herbs preventative, get your nicotine patch, and get on the book and subscribe to my station, please. I like to get more information out to everybody because you're getting the truth, guys. You're not getting the filtered information. You're getting it unfiltered from Dr. Price here. Guys, y'all have a wonderful day. I'll see you next time. Take care.